Hey guys, sorry I'm uber late. Also, I didn't get to do last week's vlog, but look, I'll make it up to all of you. This video will have both topics from this week and last week. <sighs> well, to start off, the bucket list. To be honest, this is how I'm going to get it out of the way. I have no idea what I really want to do before I die, but just the only one thing that I'd really love to do would be to travel, especially around Europe. Um, sorry to any any Americans, but I don't really have that sort of feeling for America. I don't, don't really want to go. I haven't been. I'll probably change my mind when I'm older, but at the moment I don't see the appeal of America. Sorry, <laughs> really sorry, but yeah, Europe's a big appeal. Italy, France, Germany, all those so, all those countries. I would love to go, especially Amsterdam. <coughs> sorry, so that gets out of the way. The bucket list. Just trying to think of anything else. No, that gets out of the way. The bucket list. Well, now for things. Holidays, holidays, things that we do in the holidays, Christmas, etc. Well, usually every single year, it's a lucky dip. I have no idea what we're going to do for Christmas. I don't know what we're doing for Christmas this year. Actually, yeah, I do. This Friday, I'm actually going up to the country, which is about five hours away from where I live, and we're going to spend Christmas there in Boxing Day for anyone else who celebrates Boxing Day. Well, Usually it's a fun time at the farm because it gets me away from everything, gives me a little bit of an escape. Love it, absolutely love it. Reason being is that you know I just get out of everything. Everything I, everything I think about is just I, I can forget it. I can forget it for however long I'm at the country, however long I'm at the farm. I escape old drama, I escape life basically, and just relax there. And. I'm not sure if any of you people who actually see stars at night, but when you're over there and you look up, you actually see the stars at night. Which is amazing because, you know, you barely see any stars if you're in the city or, you know, in suburban areas, you barely see stars. But if you go out to the country, country Australia, you look up at night and it's just amazing. It's just riveting. Uh, you have no idea. So. That's what we're doing this, this Christmas, but other things that I've done in the past, Christmas, well, what have I done? Been overseas twice. I know, once. Once we went to the Philippines, which is home country, yet I'm still born here in Australia. Um, we went there for Christmas with all the family, and um, I guess <laughs> the worst bit about that was. Um, my grandfather died the um, uh, that same month. Yeah, the same month, and we um, oh, it was the month before, and it was that Christmas would have been the first time us, everybody as a family, were there together. But you know, we were missing that one person, having that missing piece. Yet, you know, at least we were all there as a family and. We can't. We we had to we had to hold together through that time, and we I, I guess that <clears throat> he wasn't he was never really like not he was never really gone for that Christmas because you know, he's there in spirit and in our thoughts and in our minds and everything. Like I'm not really a, a religious person, but I just think yeah, he was he was there in my thoughts and everybody else's thoughts that Christmas. So that was my one Christmas to Philippines but every other time I've had Christmas well um I haven't really done much it's just either you know stay at home usually my parents will drag me along to the midnight mass or something or some Christmas mass or something like that I don't really care but personally it's just a waste of time sorry to any of you out there who might take offense to that but that's how I view it, but um, that's about it. Uh, <clears throat> so, it for Christmas, I guess, and 
there's nothing else that I really get into or do. But I think it's suitable if I take you guys down and look at my Christmas tree just to kill a bit of time. Alright. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. See ya.